just filming this hype of money and it is nice here. We're here at Jamrock. We'll give you a little light. We'll give you a little light here. So if the food is not and this is our group of fish, rice and peas. And sometimes you have to finish and add some more. Wow! Little mixed veggie and some plantains. And this is paradise here at Jamrock. Yeah, niceness. And this is where you should be, family. It's you no know, all that good stuff right here. Jamrock Oak Plaza off Spintex Road, and we're enjoying it. Nice, right? Oh, no, no, no. This is a restaurant. No, this is a restaurant. Yes, yeah, are you ready for nightlife? Are you ready for set up for the night? Mr. Bomani, do not oh, keep yeah. this man up because you gotta get up in the morning. Wait, I wanna stay back at the hotel. There's nobody to watch you. We're gonna make sure we all get some rest and get up in the morning and enjoy the, enjoy the day. Hopefully everybody know what we're doing tomorrow because they read the schedule or they read yep, the book. Exactly. <laughs> See, I, was actually, I love that. I actually was going to tease you. Other than that, yeah. um, look this forward to seeing everybody at 8.30 in the morning. What are you going to do tomorrow? <laughs> See, what I was going to do was I was going to keep asking you what we were doing every day. Usually what I do, after a while I start texting people. <laughs> and I'll just text them the itinerary. What are we doing now? Okay. What are we doing? What are we doing? Uh, yeah, so <laughs> the purpose of the schedule, honestly, yeah. family, is that way. We followed as best as possible, but it's um, it's everything's gonna be basically as the schedule lays it out, and I would have, you know, with exception a few adjustments. Yeah, there's enough food for like three days, right? One person who um, got left back, uh, that's about it. Oh, we just walk around and everybody in our group is here. Right? Yeah, everybody's here. There's two guys got up and did something else. Not to the benefit, to the benefit. And for the people who are ready to leave, we'll make sure we get you back. And I'll give you the schedule and I'll even text it on WhatsApp. And then we'll see you in the morning. Okay. And for those who want to stay up, we can jam by the bar, get some more rum punch, yeah. some more niceness, and socialize. <laughs> and then we'll take an individual vehicle back. So, don't want to rush anybody, but don't want to also keep anybody up. Nice. You got to enjoy every minute of it while it lasts. The next minute, you're back in solidified, con uh, solitary confinement. Is that what they call it? Yes. <laughs> The divided snakes. <laughs> Family, you never felt freedom until you're in Africa. Trust me. If you've been in America all your life, you've never felt freedom. Trust me. 
It's it's you know it's a freedom that gives you a nice paycheck. You turn around the hundred thousand dollars a year you make, you turn around and spend one hundred and ten thousand dollars a year. So it's, it's, a, it's a sham system, man. You know, you know what? Like they say, what you know, everything that glitters is isn't, isn't gold. <laughs> And that's the that's the that's the divide of snakes right there. Glitters, but it's definitely not gold. <laughs> but appreciate the opportunity to make a living and do some things. And we're gonna recycle the resources and big up Africa. That's right. That's the best thing you can get from some of these fake so-called developed countries. And then you have good people in the, in, 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 in these developed nations. You know, so we're showing everyone that hey, we're in Africa, free, enjoying life. You can just come join us, put your money together with our money, and let's build a black empire globally. So next time I tell them, don't bring out too many food. Right? It was too much, right? It's enough for you to eat tomorrow. It's a lot of food. What you got? You got the fish too? Yeah. Oh, okay. With the plantain, Jane? With the plantain? It's heavy, so you might have to eat it for breakfast tomorrow. Yeah. <laughs> you can take it with you, right? <laughs> yeah, usually what you do, you take stuff with you. We know from experience, end up in the trash. Right. <laughs> and I tell this when he played me, he tried to do work, it work me over all the time. I was like, yo, it's gonna go in the trash. And then two days later, it's in the fridge. <laughs> and what do you do? Put in the trash. <laughs> because the best time to get your food, man. I tell you about it. It went when it's cooked, you know. And, and if you're gonna eat fast food and play around like that, you better eat it right away. Cause after you, after like oh, ten yeah. minutes, it's no good. Oh, yeah. And, that's why, and, that's why and I don't, don't heat it back up. <laughs> Cause this is gonna be hard. Exactly. <laughs> this food you can kind of like steam, and you know, someone like myself is just, you know, get the pot ready and just kind of, you know, mix it up in the pot and get it warm, and then you can eat it cause it's real food. Cause it's real food. But that food, like you Try, said, you can't, you can't eat that. My all. sister. Don't run off! Don't run off from us, or we have to send a manhunt for you. Don't run away, or we're gonna send a manhunt for you. <laughs> I got you. That's one of our networking friends. Okay. Things like that. I know people like to believe every woman, but my name waves Hannah is his wife. Or things okay. like that. Not true, family. I never thought. That. <laughs> Not true, family. Yeah, Have you seen pictures of my? My, my sisters and my you know, people doing business with me and uh -huh. like, hey, can I be, you know, can I be a, a brother from, you know, from the hood in Jamaica that, you know, take beautiful pictures of beautiful people? Can I, can I rise in society? <laughs> but yeah, family, a whole lot of networking. Uh, we got citizenship conference tomorrow, then we got business conference, then we got our last day here Friday, we're in Accra. And yeah, another thing too, the, like the planes where we fly over the building. Fly over the building, so that's what you see. So we are at uh, East Airport uh, on Spintex Road. Text your boss and tell him that um, tell him that you went to a place in Jamrock and life was so good. You ate so good you, you couldn't wake back up quick in the morning. <laughs> and that's a mess to work. But no, we know we don't want to do it. I got, I got told my brother when he quit. I was like, yo, you quit your job for real? I was like, yo, jobs don't come by like that, yo. Your, your brother? Um, my brother, my good brother, yeah, oh, right there. Oh, he quit. And I always tell people, I'm gonna go re up. I'm always telling people, don't, 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 don't quit to come work with me because you know what I'm saying. Unless you really want to be a hustler. Uh, yeah, not I, not I can do it for you because all we, because we just gotta get up every day and work wow. on creating things different. You know, and our world is. The African connection mm -hmm. and things like that, and putting our money together, you know, things that you have to really just structure and it takes versus somebody years. giving you a salary. Mm -hmm. you have to, you know, so. But I mean, even when you're in business for your top, it takes a good two to five years to really see the results. Yeah. Or, or people like myself would like to say five to ten years. Yeah, really? Or like to say uh, your lifetime. Mm -hmm. uh, so you have to ask people all the time do they want it? But, yeah. but, yeah. but yeah. 
you know, we're getting into business to, to connect us as a people, not necessarily feel like it's less to work, it's less work, or even the exact order yeah. to make you rich. Yeah, it's about, I believe all those things will come. Right, it'll come here. Yeah, if you put the work in, and that's the biggest thing I tell people. Exactly. We just gotta be willing to put the work in. You know, our ancestors, they feel us. You know, when I'm going to the dungeons, I hear the spirit, I hear the energy, and they're saying, family, keep it going. That's what they're saying. When I'm in well, Cape Coast or whatever country I go to, I get the same energy from the ancestors. You know what, keep going, keep fighting, don't give up. And you film all the time, and you just still get a different experience every time you come. There ain't no better feeling than being here, I'm telling you. Being in this divided snakes is like solitary confinement. Being here is like what is freedom. I never knew, never I never known freedom until I came to Africa. Never do, right? I thought I was free when, until I came to Africa, honestly. Mm -hmm. And that's why I never stopped coming from when I was 2004. And even if I got to work hard for a whole year and just get two weeks off to go to come into Africa, I'm willing to do it. It's just that precious of time. You know, just nothing but love and you know so glad I was able to come. it's better than the odd other thing you know people you walk in people like when I was in New York people just if you look at somebody they're like you're like what the yeah yeah, you're looking yeah at, like, like and you I'm got like, 10 heads and I'm not saying hello yeah. <laughs> <laughs> here it's just so beautiful you meet people they stop and greet you and ask you how you are how was the day your family and mm -hmm. I mean it's incredible I mean it's humane okay. mm -hmm. what my brother Kavna got plenty of stories because I heard all of them. I think most of them anyway. They tell you how Ghanaians are so polite that they insult you politely. Right, 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 Kavna? <laughs> that's that's one of your favorite stories. I like that too. They say Ghanaians are so polite that they'll insult you politely. Oh, there is a, there is a, there is a, 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 a certain. Somebody sitting here. Big Ben. Uh, you can, uh, they will insult you and you will laugh. You know, even sometimes when they want to insult you, they will, they will ask of your What's up, man? Indulgence before they insult you. Yeah, I got you. It's so funny. They will ask of your indulgence before they insult you. I gotta look at the schedule. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna send everybody the schedule because we gotta do a little touch up. We're going up to the mountains. Oh, wow. Did you do the slave trading thing? Yes. We're going up to the mountains, the orphanage, uh, the botanic garden. We're going to the wood carving village, things like that. Then the next day, we're going to go to uh, the city tour. Then the day after that, we're going to go to prom prom. So you were just a whole I can talk to you about that, mister. Superboy is funny, man. Superboy is funny, family. I'm trying to eat my food. Superboy asks me kind of question. Because I think I remember seeing you. Yes, 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 yes. And it was several years. When they come, I'm going to rum punch um, for you. <laughs> that way you can get the feeling of it. Yeah. Okay. And then we'll get you a rum punch. A rum punch. Yeah, but if you've never been here before, yeah. I always try to introduce, I always try to introduce um, black folks on the diaspora here. Just like any other thing that comes to like the diaspora, okay. like we came and put our energy in. Okay. Because okay. people like to make it seem like we don't, we make, we make great contributions right. beyond the Indians and the Chinese, all the other people, exactly. all the people praise. And I tell them that's sad. Because when we come and we do things at schools and orphanages, it's out of our heart. It's not like a public relations stunt. Absolutely. And squeeze anyone, and um, I'll get them to get us up. And a uh, few people are going to go back, and then some of us are going to stay in network a little bit. Okay, okay. Okay. Yes, 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 yes. You look too excited. Okay. When you don't know. See, one thing that I always see. You know, but man, I thought he knew it. I'm a cousin. He said he was not familiar with that. You was at yeah you because uh, when you did a New Year's party with us, my sister. When we did a New Year's party, um, you was there. That's one Africa. I'm a cuz uh, she's in Rwanda. She wasn't there in Ghana. Uh -huh. oh, okay. Yeah, but that that is her resort. She built that from nothing. I remember when there was nothing there. Wow. Uh, you, you want, unless you want something else. Uh, can you get, can you get a, a jam uh, get a, a jam rock or rum punch for my sister? Uh, you want a strong? Or so, you want a strong? I'm actually strong. Yeah. Let me get two. Let me get two nice and strong. Gigi, you want another one? Here. I don't have to. Might not make it work in the morning, right? You're not gonna work. Oh, okay, perfect. You can party with us tonight, then. Okay, perfect. So she, 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 she,
we uh, one punch, nice and strong. Perfect, uh, yes, my sister, absolutely. And, and Big Ben, come on over here, man. This is my partner, right? This is my brother, right here, man. He probably don't like, why, why about money like me so much, man? Because you're, you're a real, you're a real OG. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is my sister, Destiny. Yeah, Destiny. Yeah. That's all. Yeah, I'm trying to remember where you're from. California. California. Did the Mexican chase you out of California? They, they, they. It's an in-house joke. I don't know. I mean, I kind of feel like they did. Because I have so many of my folks. They leave from California, they come to Georgia, and they're like, the Mexicans, they come to take over here. I was like, I know. That's why I'm trying to make my way out. <laughs> so you're from California, what part? Washington, That's his family, so... Yeah, you want to? I don't know. I've never been here, but... Yeah, East, you're, you're like me, an East Coast person, right? You've been on East Coast all your life? Yeah. On the East Coast all my life. Yeah. you got so many wonderful places in the East Coast. I ran away from New York. I escaped New York actually, and I moved south. And life has been good. And I just found out about African for the Africans just like less than two weeks ago. It's a family, it's a whole lot of networking energy going on here. So that's kind of what we're doing. We're more than just showing you how we eat this wonderful food. I've been watching about four years. There's another plane flying over the building. So, so you also get a nice aerial view of a plane, and you're just hoping that it doesn't come any closer than it does come. Okay. Sure, you should wait for like 30 minutes before you go. Yeah. It'll help yourself. Now, COVID is part of our. Don't get, don't get lost. Yeah, so COVID doesn't exist over here. No, no, no. We are not accepted. It doesn't exist because Africa will burn you. That's what's up to you. You don't be wearing your mask? You don't be wearing your mask? No, no. I know. You know what I mean? Face diaper. Yeah. Crazy. 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 So, what is your family but you look free, you look liberated. Like that, that's how everybody oh, look when I see them. <laughs> when I see my pe people in the snakes, yeah. they look like, you know, it's, an, it's another session of slavery. Oh, wow. So seven years, huh? Yeah. Wow. Yeah. But I want to sell it now because I'm... Hey family, people are moving, and that's all we've been about, family. Just living, doing business in Africa. Uh, you know? Yeah. It's documented. YouTube, Facebook, just online. Why don't you get it on at the Cape Coast or Accra or Mumbai and travel all over? Cape Coast is definitely one of the areas that I've already started looking at. Yeah, it's a nice place. Yeah, I know. I live. I just left from over there yesterday. So, family, I stayed over there the whole time. There'll be some more views and some more experience and things like that. And trust me, you wish you was eating this food versus. I hope you're not eating no McDonald's or anything like that. Yeah, so. I can get you a nice chef. No. Let's enjoy the good times. There's a lot of traffic, so people are moving to Central. Yeah, you're right. That's where, you're right. That's where, you're right. That's where I'm moving. That's, that's where I'm building my hotel. That's where I'm building my hotel. I got you. Congratulations. Yeah. 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 Yeah.